Hey everybody, Will Tompkins here at uh, Tom Cruise Studios, live music in Austin, bringing you episode number seven of Three Beers and Whiskey, featuring an interview with the Soapboxers. Here's beer number two. You know, with the, the new music I was granted from uh, the Revenge Wedding, you know, hopefully awesome. they've got a bunch of people out there. Um, so you said you're going going to go into the studio for an EP in, starting in December. So all the music's written, ready to go. <laughs> sure. <laughs> Most of it. I think we, I think we might actually have another writing session just to put one. So fresh. what are we talking about in the EP? Three songs? Probably five? Four. Four? Okay. Um, two of them are done. Possibly. Okay. We don't know what we're putting in. Yeah. <laughs> we actually went into the studio this summer and recorded a, a couple of tracks, one of which we and recorded all the port, uh, all parts to. It's before we had Jamie on board or Wes or, or Kit. Actually, it was just us two. Yeah. We were bored. So you all did all the parts yourselves? We just yeah. did I played drums yeah. and keys really? and sang, and he played guitar and bass. I talked to Bobby Bookout. He was on with us a couple weeks Love ago. Um, and there's other people that have talked about the, the, the format, the art of, of CDs is pretty much a full length of disc is going by the wayside. By the wayside. I mean, because everybody doesn't, you know, go out. It's, it's the digital format, the, the live stream, you're going to listen to it streaming music, or you'll buy singles. So is that going to have an impact on you guys? Like, you're doing the EP, and after that, is that a consideration? Like you're like, well, you know, we're just going to start doing singles, putting out videos to it. Yeah. Have you have the mind yet? No, absolutely. I mean, I think you know, we put out a full length album this year, and we had wanted to do that for a while. We had put out two EPs previous to that. Okay. I think, yeah. I think you're right. You know, EPs and singles kind of seem to be the way that. I think Spotify's done a really good job of that. Okay. Um, and I agree. I, you know, spot it's super easy. I don't know how the payout goes on that. You know, a million hits for a dollar. Yeah. I made like, like, like three dollars. Or yeah, have it, has it crossed your mind yet? <laughs> no, absolutely. I mean, I think you know we put out a full length album this year, and we had wanted to do that for a while. We had put out two EPs previous to that. And okay. I think, yeah. I think you're right. You know, EPs and singles kind of seem to be the way that. I think Spotify's done a really good job. Yeah. Okay. Um, and I agree. I, you know, spot. It's super easy. I don't know how the, the payout goes on that. You know, a million hits for a dollar. Yeah. 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 Um, yeah. Like a lot of, of like three dollars. I mean, I, I'm very much old school enough where I, I like to have the tangible product in my Most in my hand. Yeah. You know, like the disc. I threw the disc in here so we listen to it. I'll rip it and I'll have it so I can play it wherever. But it really is like it's super nice to still have that. Um, but I also see the point where. You know, do I listen to the whole entire disc all the way through, or there are a couple songs I pick, and yeah, it makes sense where I can see where everything's going like that. I think it's nice to have the whole album so that you can kind of feel like just some, you know, well, the gives, whole vibe of the artist and like what they're going through at a certain time in their lives. The platform like, to tell your story. You know, and, and that's what I want to have still. Like, I mean, it's great to be able to pick out your favorite songs from the album and put mm -hmm. it on, you know, like a mixtape. Yeah. If you guys do that. Mixtape. I think that's why the vinyl is so cool now that you put down and you're almost forced to, yeah. for an hour, dedicate your life to an artist and a state of mind. Yep. It's great. Yeah. It's fantastic. I'll, so, play, yeah. I'll, I'll play Devil's Advocate for a second because I, I don't know. I have a different take on it maybe sometimes, but I think uh, I think as albums uh, become something else, mm -hmm. and I, I, I mean, I, would, I think it would really suck if all we had were singles, but... I think it becomes like an artist's expression how they put out the music. Whether yeah. it's maybe it's six songs, maybe it's twenty songs, maybe it's a live album, maybe it's not, it's, maybe it's a mix. I think it's. I think there's something beautiful about an album or just things put together however you want. That that it's. You know, I it's whatever you I can. totally agree with you, and I I hope and think and wish that the the full CD full album doesn't go away ever. No. Um, <laughs> But it just seems like so much is pushing towards that. I think we've got something coming off the internet over there. Uh, sorry, everybody. My apologies. Who is my beautiful, beautiful wife, Marissa Cruz Tompkins. She's running the internet, pouring our beers tonight. Thank you very much, ma'am. And um, so what do you have going on? I just want to take this opportunity to, number one, thank you, all of you, for thank being you. here. And we have a couple of shout outs. There's uh, some people that we want to say hello to. Number one, Bobby Bookout is on right oh, now. Hey, Bobby! And he wants is to. Is he mad that he didn't get to come eat beans? He wants to let Will know. Don't forget to give them 
your the CDs. CDs. Yes. Yep. They're right here, Bobby. They're right Jeff there. Uh, and Jeff that. actually already asked about it, so yes. hopefully you, we'll all be straight enough at the end of the show so you pack them away. I'll need a room. And then we want to say hi to Sunny Beal. Sunny, hey. And then a couple of shout outs for Nancy, Ryan, and Jennifer Mooney. Hi. Videos. I mean, you got, we're talking about the EP. Uh, what's going on with like doing a video or what? Well, we had a really good idea yeah. at Utopia Fest, remember? Oh, are we, are I don't we think we should tell this? everyone. It's probably going to be good. No, no let's do it. 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 Let's
Lucky anyway, <laughs> we might be another moment or two before the next round of beers. Ooh, actually, it's almost whiskey time. It's oh, almost yeah. whiskey time. Yeah. Yeah. So, so, um, are we? No, I'm just kidding. Whiskey time. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> like, oh, uh, he's all like, you know, I caught myself doing that on uh, one of the shows. Like, hey, so in about 45 minutes, and I didn't have a watch on, and I'm looking at my wrist, and I was like, and I go back and I look at the video, and I was like, fucking stupid ass. And I'm all like, hey, you see the white strip where there's no tan? And I'm all like, uh, it's a half past freckle. Um, so, uh, video, you were. Hinting about an idea that you have. Yeah, you're not gonna. No, no, no. no, 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 no. Is there there a timeline for you guys to drop something like that? Uh, I I feel like we need to make sure everyone is down for it. Yeah, we don't know what to say. We haven't told anybody else. (laughs) Yeah, no one else knows. So I want to choose to discuss. Thought of this at Utopia Fest together. No one else could leak. I'm yeah, sure it was all like, it, it started with a P and ended with an Aoyote. Hey, hey, We thought of lots of stuff. No. There were plenty of colors we smelled. No. <laughs> we're only so, keeping yeah. one of the ideas that we came up with. Very oh, cool. Oh, are we? That's good. What was the other one? Oh. Well, well, we can't. Oh. <laughs> yeah, the Sorry, you guys. We're just uh, uh, no, we're no, being so loud. Well, you don't want to hear the bad yeah. ones. Oh, uh, so are there any <laughs> side? It is you know, soapboxers it, it are you guys right here that are sitting with us. Are there any side projects that you know any of you are? are oh, yeah. well, let's talk about it. Yeah. All right. So yeah, um, I am um, just today. Actually, I was just talking to a couple gals from Ready Betty that I used to play with. So. Really? Yeah, we're the ex Wait, wait. Oh, oh I God. sat next at uh, Donnell's uh, wake or at the the party at Come and Take It. I sat next to one of the one of the Bettys. One of the Bettys, oh, yeah. 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 So Are they, I was I, one of the Bettys for a little bit there, yeah. Uh, mm-hmm. So anyway, go ahead. Not what for was, very long. I think what's was the project the, you're working on? I worked the band for maybe like six months, and then the band disbanded, and then uh, now we're you know. A couple of us are getting back together. And cool. Is it going to have obviously a different name? Different, I mean, what uh, is something you want to talk so Virginia about? Virginia and Katie and okay. I are going to get together on Sunday at 1 o'clock, and that's as much as I... I don't know. That's all I okay. know so far. Um, I'm really looking forward to it, though. Yeah, I miss playing with those gals. away from us. Yeah. Just, you know what? I just didn't wait. Wait. I've been it's, waiting for something else. It's to come all out. the testosterone. Yeah. 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 Oh, oh yeah. Well, I will. I will say. Wes, Wes or yeah. any of you guys got anything? Yeah. I mean, Wes, this is actually, pretty interesting. Wes, if you want to, oh, Wes, yeah. elaborate yeah. here. Wes is all over Tell somebody. Wes is a busy guy. Yeah. So I played a few groups. Um, Fragile Rock is one that I play with a lot, which is yeah. awesome. If you guys know them, they're hilarious. We're playing at Stubbs tomorrow night. Oh, oh shit! Yeah. Steps and oh, yeah. Yeah, steps nice. And nice. All right. Uh, Wrong bird is doing an EP release. You guys awesome, should have a Wrong bird on. Great guys. Okay. Here's Here's band, band. Actually, yeah, Great yeah. guy. And we're playing with Big Wise Brass Band too. Oh, yeah. 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 We saw cool. them at Waterloo. Yeah. yeah, yeah. That is awesome. Come see They're you. awesome at Waterloo. Yeah, from what I remember. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Will Tompkins, from me and everybody here at Three Beers and a Whiskey. Thank you very much for tuning in. Uh, Make sure if you uh, like what you saw, you hit the thumbs up button. If you didn't like what you saw, hit the thumbs up button. Uh, Subscribe and also click on the notification bell so that you won't miss future videos from Three Beers and a Whiskey. Thank you all very much.